Hello everybody, this is Tim from Boats Your Drop Brokers and we're on board this smart liner today for a look around her cockpit and bow rider section in glorious virtual reality. So what does this mean to you? That means all you need to do is swipe your screen up, down, left and right. You can look where you like, when you like, you don't have to look where Tim's looking. We hope that that will give you a really good idea as to what it's like on this boat. Now some people do find the movement of the camera a little bit sensitive for them so this may not be the video for you if that's the case but uh, if you're okay with it you can follow me around and we'll have a good look around together but let's hope that's not the case so here we are we uh, if we just look around us we can see we're standing in the aft section of the cockpit looking over the stern and we can see that we've got a, a lovely swim platform to either side the port side has got the swim ladder uh, embedded into it as well so to get out it's just to, uh, basically a, a, a foot on the uh, on the cockpit seat don't tell dad or mum Lego uh, right to this section here, onto the after platform, down to the swim platform. So really nice and easy to get down there. And we've got a nice handhold as well to help us to get on and off as well. Absolutely fantastic. In the middle to midships, we've got the Tohatsu engine. Um, I like the fact it's, it's cool, it's white, it looks contemporary, it looks smart, it looks sleek. It's a modern engine, but it's really great. Um, hardly any hours as this boat hasn't hardly been used effectively. Which is really so there's the, uh, the starboard swim platform, very, very similar to the port one, but without the swim ladder. And then that brings us up to the cockpit. Now, if I stand here and hold you as still as I can, if you look around, you can see that we've got seating across the stern. If we just pull the lid up or the seat up, we've got uh, a gargantuan stowage underneath with batteries in, bilge pump, plenty of room for your uh, picnic baskets, your suitcases, your beach balls, deck chairs, whatever you'd like to put down there, all out of sight, out of mind, which is lovely. And then, if you look around the rest of the cockpit, you can see on the port side here, we've got the first mate seat or the partner seat, whatever you'd like to call it, but a lovely seat it is too. Very nice and comfy to sit in. We've got side support. We've got the bolster down for a nice comfy seat. We've got the bolster up for fun and products on the waves. And we've also got something to hold onto here and a cup holder there and a screen to keep the worst of the elements off, which I really, really love. The same on the starboard side seat wise. We've got a really nice seat here bolsters down there for relaxing a little bit uh, just nestled, nestling behind us we have the uh, the stereo speakers there two here two in the bow rider section if you just take a little seat down and try and hold you still you can see i've got my arm up we're cruising i would have my left hand on the steering wheel and uh, i'd have my right hand on the throttle here so nice and easy to control we have the uh, tilt controls here uh, which is in neutral at the moment and uh, we would have uh, we have got a bimini just lying across the after section there as you can see we would have a lovely big sun cover over us if we wanted it that would clip in there so we can sit here all day having fun while the kids are being towed away towed around at the back having their fun brilliant so right again we've got the screen in front of us we've got the wheel in front of us we've got the electrics panel hummingbird i think this is fish finder and uh, chart plotter to be confirmed but uh, certainly a nice instrument there stereo controls engine speed engine trim and the uh, the fuel uh, indication there and the cup holder so that's where we stick our can of coke not beer because uh, from the RNLI, beer and uh, boats don't really mix very well, as I know from experience from the RNLI side, not the drinking beer side. Uh, anyway, that's a different story. But um, as we uh, let's stand up and move forwards through the companionway, nice and easy here. So we're going to make our way through, just turning sideways side slightly, and that takes us down to the the uh, the bow rider area. Now this is a bow rider because you can sit in the bow. Now you're at the front of the boat, so if it's choppy or wavy, you're going to be the ones going up and down. So we need you to be comfortable. So for that reason, we give you lots of cushions. We can fill the middle in with cushions if we want to, to make it a great big bed. We've got backrests, we've got side rests, etc., etc. We'll explain which one's lovely. And uh, really, really importantly, Apart from the cup holders, obviously, we've got the, the lovely big grab rails here, which so are always something to hold on down here. And if you are in a bow rider, if you haven't been in one before, excuse me, it will be bouncy. This is a smaller boat, fairly lightweight, so she's going to be lively, which is great for water skiing, uh, wakeboarding, all that kind of stuff. And uh, this is where we look over the front. Small uh, fore deck there, nav lights port and starboard for safety at sea, which is really important. And uh, if we just turn around a little bit, or you can swivel your camera, look for see just how nice and white and modern and new this boat looks. She's not a new boat but she's not far off it. Lovely screens there as well. So this has been Tim from Boat Show Drop Rokers just taking you for a good tour of the cockpit and the bow rider section of this bow rider. And uh, thanks for watching and uh, if you do enjoy these videos do go to our YouTube channel Boat Show Drop Rokers where you'll find lots more people where you find lots more videos of all boats from smaller ones like this lovely modern sleek speed boats to whacking great big small ships and gin palaces all over Sussex, Brighton and Eastbourne. Thanks for watching, take care, have a great day.